Hello and welcome to, if that's still on, what's it going? Uh, welcome to an extra special Varsity Super Saturday vlog. I'm Head of Sport for Raw and Warrington Peter Marshall. And today there is a number of amazing varsity matches going on across Warwick Campus. So we're currently down in place for women's football. Myself and my illustrious uh, media team, there is uh, Jack Abbey over there working the camera. And uh, over there you can just make out Henry Riley from the show Unstructured Ramblings. And what we're going to try and do now is uh, go around every single game that's being played today. So there's Ulmer oh, Frisbee that's over there, um, sort of uh, in the varsity field. There's rugby league going on over there. There's women's basketball that should be underway now in the sports hall. So hockey is here later. I'm going to try and get as comprehensive a coverage because, to be honest, we can't get any power here, so we can't do it broadcast as we can. As there's a chance, and it's very exciting, it's 1-0 here now at the place, and that's broken down. A uh, girl called Chrissy, I don't know her second name, has been really good. She scored a goal, and Laura, I think, scored one before, as we're through here. That's going to nothing. But yes, it's going to be a good day, and we're losing varsity at the moment, and I will have to, I don't know, pie Alex Roberts on a piazza for every day next week if we actually lose varsity. It's not going to happen. We're going to win, and Super Saturday, we'll when we turn it around. All to come. The winner takes it all. The loser standing small. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh! <gasps> Woo. Right, so it's half time in women's football. Oh, sorry. <laughs> We're live now. This is uh, Henry and Jeff from Unstuck Ramblings. We just saw an incredible goal Absolutely from, um, I don't know who, yeah. Absolutely Worldy, which <laughs> you will have seen too. I'm amazed by it. Um, Turn and shot. I think we all got footage of that as well, didn't we? Yeah, we all got footage actually. Uh, so now we're moving on to Rugby League over there. It's half time over here, we might be back there. But yeah, it's all going down on Super Saturday. So we're here, we're here now with Joseph and we're down at the Rugby League. So how's it looking, Joseph? What's the score? Things aren't looking good. They are. Yeah, 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 so a bit of a turnaround then. Yeah, they've got a much bigger score than us that you know, playing in the weeks above. Yeah. Um, they're just, they're just hitting us for the momentum that we can't really match at the moment. Um, we've got uh, Dave O'Connor and uh, Jack Buckley, the uh, captain, yeah. giving big talks at half-time. And so uh, I hope you see more come out with it. Yeah. So are there, any, are there any silver linings here or is it about as depressing as an Aston Villa Christmas party? It's, it's not quite as bad as that. No, it's we, not we've had, We had a lot of momentum in the first half. Okay. The first half. Um, but they've got a couple of very big, very fast guys that have just broken the line a couple of times. Yeah. And it's uh, sapping around. Well, we have a lot of faith. Cheers, Joseph. Right, we're back. Jack and Tim here. Hello. So it's the second half in the women's football. Um, Cov have just scored, which is a bit crap. Um, and Henry is staying behind to get footage, but we're off now to Ultimate Frisbee and women's basketball to see how things are going there. Because if we lose varsity, I will have to, um, I will have to kill Alex Roberts. It's going to have to happen. <laughs> we're just going to have to murder him. So we'll see what happens. So we're working our way towards the Ultimate Frisbee fields now. And one thing I have to point out, Jack. So. You see the place over there? Yeah. Would you say, based on the fact that we're basically at Warwick, it is a Warwick University or a Cobb University ground? It's probably Warwick. It's Cobb. It's Cobb. It is literally, literally the Falklands, this place. <laughs> it's just not. It's like no reason that it's Coventry. I don't even know. But anyway, hold on for to come. We're here with it's Ball Sport editor Shiggy Maruki, everyone. Woo! I'm a bit bewildered. Hi. How how are you? You enjoying yourself, mate? Not awful, not awful. I'm about to start live vlogging, so I decided to come to the most exotic sport where it has to offer. It, it really is. Oh, I'm a frisbee. Oh. It's like it's like the Bahamas of the sporting world, I say. Like they have nice kit. Like, they do have lonely kit. You're fulfilling the, the legacy of your predecessor, Luke Brown. He was sat just over there I swear he sat last year, and, and he and he threw a frisbee at my head just like there I, last year. So I, I'm a nice guy. I'm not gonna. You're not gonna do it. We I hope it doesn't happen again. We hope no, it doesn't happen again. Um, but yeah, go for it. Go yeah, looking forward to today. Right, so we're here now with Andres from Frisbee. It's going pretty well. What's the score at the moment? Mate? So yeah, it's 13-5 uh, against 14. 
So one more point and we've got it. Yeah, absolutely. And how are you feeling about the last two overall? You think it's going well? Yeah, it's going well. It's obviously a lot closer this year. Um, great games. I was up the netball yesterday. Yeah. Unfortunate loss. But yeah, hopefully we can pull away today. Yeah, unfortunate loss, but overall, you know, great day for Team Warwick. Ah, oh, fuck. Sim again. <laughs> it's again. <laughs> get, get back here. So all but wrapped up after my second assault by a boar sport editor. I don't know what they're like, they just hate me. But all but wrapped up here at uh, Frisbee. It's, uh, yeah, like I said, I think it's 13-4 and it's 14 to win. So uh, really happy about that one. You enjoying yourself, Jack? Yeah, I'm enjoying myself. It's good. Fantastic. Do you enjoy it. watching me get hit in the head with a Frisbee? It was a good sight. It is a bit of a Lamborghini. Oh, it's a Lamborghini Mercury Lago. Oh, it's beautiful. Look at that car. We need we need proper car racing in um in Varsity. That's what we need. <laughs> Devastating news. We've just found out it is three all in the football. Yes! Yes! Uh, I'm sorry Alex Roberts, but it looks like uh, your days on this earth are numbered. <laughs> I don't I don't want it to turn to like a mob mentality, but you know. Well, has to it's be, has clearly to be. the sports officer's fault, I'm just saying. What have we got here? Look at these banners, you know, it's all good. Everything's been going really well. Oh, this is some soft focus work now. Just, you know, it's not, it's not, it's not going our way today. Coming up to the Warwick Sports Centre now, really amazing building. I mean, just the, these guys are absolute legends. They helped us so much with netball and the facilities they've got are top, top, top universities in the UK, undeniably. So we're here for women's basketball. Let's hope we're winning. Well, I mean, the famed stairs of the University of Warwick Mating Hall and the Sports Centre. And here we have it. Actually winning. Now we're here with uh, Aline Giovanni, I think it's all right, at the uh, women's basketball, and it's looking a lot better here than a lot of other places. It's 31 18, so how are you doing? How, yeah, how are we're we looking here? We're recovering from uh, last night's loss, unfortunate loss. Uh, the girls are doing a really good job right now, though, getting us back into a uh, winning spirit, hopefully, winning varsity now. So they're doing a good job, already up by 12 right now, and hopefully they just extend this lead. Yeah, and after your co-commentary experience yesterday, are you hoping to be like the next, well not Michael Owen, he's rubbish, but like next uh, next Gary Neville maybe? Yeah, you never know, you I might just take Rio's, Rio Ferdinand's position, yeah, you never know. Yeah, I can I see it happening. <laughs> You're better dressed than Rio, you've got all this, you'd appreciate it. Anyway, yeah, so we're looking good here for Team Warwick. Yeah, Cheers, I mean, everyone, we have the little hard work cut out to stuff. Yeah, it's great atmosphere. Cheers, Lee. No worries, take care. Say something, James Radden, who is the uh, the coach there, you can see. Striking resemblance to Conor McGregor, and was wearing a full tweed suit before. So, hey, what's up with the big printouts? Is that Claire Wood's face there? No, this who is, is Anthony. Anthony, uh, yeah. It looked like. So, so is this some kind of? I heard from James it was an American thing. Yeah, exactly. Well, we, we saw these videos online of uh, different teams and their fans doing this, and we thought we like put our own little thing together, so we brought more yeah. suits. <laughs> Little banners. Yeah. We have a curtain, so when they shoot free throws, sometimes they just go and like surprise do, them. Does the something. team appreciate it? Do you think? Yeah, I think everyone. Yeah, I, really, I think everyone really likes it. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, well, it seems to be doing a trick so far. Yeah, we're doing pretty well. Here we go. Yeah, 32 18. It's looking good. So till still me and Jack Elms. Seems yeah. all the way in on oh, you there. Sorry, mate. I was getting in focus. Whoa. Bad production <laughs> quality. So uh, walking away from uh, basketball now. All good there. All good. 32-18 um, or something like that. We're winning that by a long way. Back into the uh, cold. Back into the cold. And now we're going to head to fencing. And I have to say, actually, it's close to my heart because I actually, uh, fun facts about me, people might not know, I fenced for four years at secondary school. I got up to grade three in Epe, and I'm also a grade one foil. Um, Sabre, it's a swishy one that everyone likes. I never did that. Never got to do that. I wasn't allowed to because everyone else was doing it. It was overbooked. But you know, I know a bit about it. So uh, it's going to be interesting. And we've heard we've won already. So we'll hopefully just get a bit of an aftermath of it. It's an RT shot. An RT shot. Team Warwick. Go Warwick. Yeah. 
So we're just getting close to Westwood Games, Games Hall now for fencing. And I should say, as someone who is in Westwood for freshers, which block are you in, Jack? I'm in Tossel. You're in Tossel. As someone who is in Westwood, it's not that far a walk, honestly. People moan about it, but it's not that bad. It freshens you up, and there's no better way to recover from a night out at Casbar than a, a nice Saturday morning stroll from Westwood to the heart of campus. That's what I'd say. There's <laughs> okay. birds, there's rabbits. There did used to be rabbits, but kind of all the construction workers scared them off a little bit. So <laughs> Forgive me if I don't give up my five minute walk in the morning. Oh well, Instead it's alright for you, day. isn't it? Yeah, it is lovely. Right, so I'm here with... Oh, do I? Who is the men's fencing captain. Um, well, how's everything gone today? It's mixed fencing, actually. Uh, it was mixed fencing, so we had three women and six men competing. Uh, we destroyed Coventry. Destroyed them? Yeah, destroyed Love it. Absolute yeah, demolition. We, we scored twice more points there. Oh. So that is what we like to hear. We, 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 we trashed it. Are you, are you worried that we might lose Varsity this year? Is it no. your second year? Because there's been a bit of rumblings around. I was saying Alex Roberts is going to be on the gallows if things keep going the way they are, you know. Honestly, I don't think this will that's be good. ever losing again to Coventry. Never again. Never, and, um, never again. That's, that's a foil you're fencing with at the moment, are you? Because yeah, I was saying exactly. I, I have a bit of experience with uh, swords, so that's, is that an epée or a foil? That's a foil. That's a foil, you see? I know what I'm doing. <laughs> uh, so how does it work, this competition? Are there foil, epée and sabre, or do you just stick to the one? No, no, basically we fence the three weapons and there are three fences by weapons so in total every fencer fences three games so it's like 27 game total yeah and up to 45 in each weapon mm. yeah and i'm familiar with the kit I look, uh, because these there are sensors attached to you guys and they go off when the sword hits exactly do you think you could have a little spa for us maybe to get a bit fresh brilliant we are now so this is me reliving my school days of fencing so i'm the referee from what i remember so uh, Here we go, so that, that was me reliving my fencing <laughs> days in my school. How do you think I did? Uh, you did all right, you did Cheers, all right, yeah. from what I can tell. I can remember the three words, well four words, on guard are you ready, play. That's more than four. But yeah, so um, we've just heard that we, um, we've draw, we're assuming we've drawn the football. I think that's what we've heard, We yeah. think we've drawn the women's football, which is a bit gutting because we were 3-1 up. And there was an absolute weldy in there, but... It was great. You know, and then um, we've won the women's rugby apparently, which we sadly didn't get any footage of. Yeah. And we can only assume lost the rugby league, so going down there soon at least. Ambulance at the place. We think it's just precautionary. <laughs> Plays appropriately named song called Ambulances. Oh, there's Henry. Here he is. It's Henry Riley, intrepid cameraman, reporter extraordinaire. Henry, what what happened? So what happened, man? Warwick was three 0 up at half time, oh. and it just it just, it just got away from them. Threw away in, in the last minute. Coventry got a, a four three winner. Was it like a Newcastle Arsenal esque capitulation? <laughs> oh, sorry, I know you're an Arsenal fan, but no, I know. Uh, you, well, Arsenal got a draw from that, but <laughs> <laughs> the, yeah, no, it was disappointing. Uh, it, the, even the team Warwick said they sort of fizzled away. Uh, just a shame. But what a, what a goal! We were singing some inappropriate songs to us, like that's three 0 and you something. Up, that's well, that's not nice of them. Right in front of our bench as well. Which yeah. Draw or a loss? No, we lost. We lost. We oh my. We thought we'd just draw. Oh, that's awkward. I think I oh, tweeted yeah. out that we drew. Oh, oh, yeah. oh. <laughs> Is it really? <laughs> Back around on the Warwick Piazza for our lunch break now. I think it's hard and it's quite a late lunch break. What time is it? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, it's four bit of a bit of a sullen mood. We're not we think we've lost uh, a few more things than we were hoping to, but hopefully we've managed to turn the deficit around and uh Yeah. 
We're still okay, confident. We're, we're, still we're, we're still confident, and yeah, at the end of the day, Coventry is chance of winning varsity probably still lower than their chances of employment, which is quite saying a lot, really. <laughs> <laughs> Shouldn't you wait till the kettle stopped boiling to vlog? <laughs> no, the kettle's fine. It's no, a well-deserved well <laughs> break in the office from the sport team. We're very tired, so we're making ourselves some coffee before we uh, die of exhaustion. Um, we're thinking the score is 26-24 now. You people are a bit confused about how Coventry have got as many points as they do. We think they probably snuck some in, or, or maybe stolen some, you know. You probably expect that from them. It's kind of like a degree there, stealing, yeah, like, probably yeah. theft. Um, but anyway, so um, we think we're in the lead. Just keep an eye on it. Tennis is underway, which we can't cover. Well, we might go down to tennis later. We've heard there's cakes. And um, as well as that, there'll be futsal, and then hockey. Hockey tonight will be very good. Could all go down to the wire at Rico, but we shall see. It's all going well, just making some coffee. Enjoying the life. At this point, all I want to do is cover Nirvana's heart shaped box, but it's going to be a cone shaped box instead. Sorry. Bad times on the, uh, the Raw Sports Super Saturday. Um, uh, what is it, vlog, because we've spent so long drinking coffee and um, slugging off Cov on Twitter, we haven't realised the women's hockey actually starts in about 10 minutes time, uh, so we should probably get down there, because we weren't actually going to win that, because the girls were unbeaten all season, 100%. So uh, we're going to go to the place now, and uh, futsal's happening, and tennis is happening, but we're not allowed to cover tennis, because bad things with tennis. <laughs> bad memories. Bad memories with tennis. So, straight to the place, straight to, um, what's it called? Um, um, okay. Falklands. That. There you go. Here we are at hockey. Great attendance. Don't know how it's split, but this is a big one. Big evening game, there you go. Home support and away support. Again. Enjoying the evening, Tim. <laughs> there we go. No goals yet, right? Is it just, just started. There you go. Brilliant. So, there's Ali Martin, Raw Sport interviewer. Conversation. Also plays a bit of hockey, but obviously it's the raw sport that counts. Update, cracking goal from Ellie Martin, Jack Alley, in a word, too zoomed in, oh no. <laughs> yeah, 1-0 up, much better. It's champagne hockey, what can I say? So we have news of brand new rule changes in hockey. Do you want to tell us why uh, this is a, a bit of a landmark game? Well, yeah, so the FIH, um, what they've done is they've changed the rules concerning free hits in the attacking 23. So now the ball must move five metres before it's played into the D. Uh, this is to stop players touching the ball and then having it injected in um, on the grounds of safety. And so all the games across England from this weekend are being played under the new rules. There you go. Amazing. Updated at hockey and the Coventry attention span is wavering. <laughs> They've started to play football instead. <laughs> Clearly, the act of multitasking just too much for them. <laughs> We've got Alex Roberts here, sports officer. It's been a bit of a roundabout day for you, hasn't it? A bit of a roller coaster of emotions. It's just a bit, mate. They've had me uh, sweating on women's football earlier. Yeah. Difficult. Um, basketball made a little bit of hard work for it in the last quarter. Yeah. But overall, it's been a very good day for us. So that, that's good. Hopefully, we'll secure the victory here and then the men's will do the same. Good performance. And going tomorrow will be looking good. Absolutely. And uh, it's the uh, women's netball flooding us with the tunes. You, you're a fan of this mix? Oh, yeah. My, my playlist. This is your right, playlist. All the time. Are you going to resign, Alex? If we if we lose Vastel, will you resign? Uh, I've got, <laughs> got, got Flyby on my um, playing on my computer, so I'm, I'm ready to depart. Just ready to emigrate and never be seen again. Yeah. <laughs> We've got Rob here now from uh, Mag Men and. Uh, you guys playing later, the girls yeah, setting up quite nicely, happy with it so far? Yeah, playing really well, playing really well. Look at the camera, promise. 
Yeah. Is this your is this your media team? Yeah. His publicist. It's my backroom staff. It's my answer. Make the camera blow up. Jeez, how big are those ears? Don't listen to a man. Fuck the haters. Fuck the haters. <laughs> We're gonna win later for us. Yeah, we should win. We should win. Yeah. Full time prediction. Full time prediction for these girls. Girls, the girls will win. Can't wait to watch this back. Five 0 oh. um, <laughs> How can they win five 0 They're playing well. Yeah. yeah. And what do you make of Coventry's footballing antics? I think we've seen Lucas Aid bottles and footballs on the pitch from there. Maybe yeah. a, bit, a bit hard to concentrate at this time. Yeah. I mean, it's tough for them. Obviously, they bottle the league like midweek, so yeah, it's always rough for them. It's tough time. It's tough time. I'm sure they're gonna lose against. Right, so if you get on camera, it's Roy Neville, nothing, it's Michaela and Sophie. Hello. I said your name right, happy. <laughs> How, are, you, are you happy about the score at half time? Right. And feeling better after yesterday. It was a bit of a rough one from you guys. We felt bad for you, but and uh, I think I, I saw via Facebook you were drowning your sorrows in neon, so probably feeling fresh this morning, right? Yeah, good times. Prediction for full time. Prediction for full time. Five nil. Five nil. I'm gonna six. Uh, and Sophie, if, if Coventry was an animal, what would it be and why? <laughs> she said it'd be a slug before. Look about. Was that, was that you? Yeah, Ricardo said that. We don't want to libel them. I'm gonna, I can't do anything! Absolutely amazing support from Warwick. Because, like, look at that. I mean, Cov, they've got a few players. It's kind of like, but, but nah, Warwick absolutely packed it out. And I mean, it is cold out here. Like, my fingers, I can't actually feel them anymore. And Henry, bless him, is trying his hardest on the cameras. <laughs> Like between us, we probably have an aggregate of about. I feel like I've got boxing gloves on. Four fingers that we can actually still feel, but yeah. between the three of us. But you know, we're endeavouring because it's varsity and we like varsity. Love it. Here's Ellie Martin on the ball. Should we do some like live commentary? Ellie Martin running down the right wing. She's one of the players' names actually know, so this is good. Apart from Holly Isles and goal, she's probably not going to come up. He says Ellie Martin. It's like watching Messi. It's liquid hockey. Ellie Martin is dispossessed, and surely that's a foul to us because, uh, or not. I'm not sure I trust him in that hood. Looks like he's a suspect. Shady character in his blue hoodie. Hello. Are you enjoying this? What is it now? Is it 4 0? I think it's 3 0. 3 0. Great play, though. Great play. And how many fingers can you feel? Do I have fingers? <laughs> yeah. Holly, are you getting bored yet? Almost. <laughs> We could play cards if you like. <laughs> you know, we're just doing so well, I don't mind being cold. Yeah, we could just do like an interview live on the pitch because the play's been quite uh, quite one end. Quite Got one some good chats. Yeah, I'm, I'm freezing. Here. Yeah, don't worry, I'll leave you to it. We'll be yeah, very I'm professional. Too much. <laughs> <laughs> well, even I'm getting bored at this end of the field now. Let's go get some like arty close up shots of the lights. Ooh. You got soft focus. Oh, wait, there you go. Yeah, they're really struggling with the concept of uh, football and hockey. We have a tough one for Cov. Oh my god, Holly actually touched the ball. Oh, come on!
Absolute demolition. I forgot what the score is. It's like five, six. Holly, what's the score? I thought it was six. More time. Hey. I'm so good. I that film though. <laughs> one save. Nice one. Guys, that's all on film. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what is it? Brilliant. Ellie Martin, Ellie Martin, instant reaction to winning. What was it? 8 0. 7 0. 7 0. Liquid hockey. Liquid hockey, that's what I said. Do you know, I was down there, I got so bored. I feel bad for Holly. It must have been. Yeah. Yeah, because I was down there in the first half. Well, the cup was nothing against the mighty white one. Do you know her one save? I don't think I got it. Oh, you're it so. Oh, no. Your one job. Your one job. But now, amazing effort from the girls. Thank you. I think you paved the way for the guys now to win. Oh, absolutely. We're expecting double our score, actually. So, you heard it here. And how does it feel to have saved Alex Roberts' job? Um, I feel like a maverick. I That's fantastic. He's the goose and I'm the maverick. <laughs> that, that was more like it, wasn't it, Alex? Absolutely. Incredibly one-sided. Um, dominated from the start and there was only ever going to be one outcome there. So, a uh, score prediction for the men's now? Um, same again. If we, same again. If we beat seven, then we'd be doing well. Um, but I don't, I don't mind. Just I take a one nil. As long as take we, a one nil. Yeah. As long as we win, I do not care. Take a one nil, but you know, eight eight would be nice. Eight Maybe eight nice, minutes. Yeah, eight or nine. One nil. Whatever. <laughs> so we've got Craig here, social sec for Magman. How you doing, Craig? Yeah, I'm good. Thank you. How are you? I'm very well, thanks. I have to say, your your, your promo video for Varsity was inspired. Yeah, it was good. They basically pick pick, pick, uh, pick the fattest person they could. I, I couldn't video. tell if it was meant to be a joke or not. Yeah, it's a joke. I'm <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm no, it, we can censor it. <laughs> it's fine. So, what's your score prediction for today then? Oh, plus 10 minimum. Plus, plus Eel, 10. Eel double hat trick. Eel double hat trick. Yeah, you got to outscore the girls at least, and they scored. Yeah, so. I mean, if the girls. I mean, the girls can put us away a single short corner routine. So. <laughs> Real shame. So, it should be good. And, uh, can we expect some uh, wild celebrations then at, at full time? Yeah, Courtney Krausen's doing the streak at half time, so uh, we'll find out like, what happens. Fantastic, I can't wait. Cheers. Excellent. <laughs> Here we go. Men's hockey mag men. Final one. Just me left. Manning the solo camera. It's a lonely, lonely life. So, it's going well. We're tuned up and I've missed both goals. One wasn't filming anything when I was drinking top load. Fantastic. It's been a very long day. Shingi, how are you doing, man? How's it been going today for you? Not too bad, thanks. How was tennis? Have we won? Uh, we won the men's, we're losing the women's. We're, we're losing awesome. the women's tennis? Is Georgia yes. Kramer playing? No, she is not. Is she gone? She was like GB, I mean, former GB number one. Nah, nah she's, I think she's graduated. Oh, I haven't That's I didn't see her. But yeah, well, we're, we smashed the poly in the men's. Should we That's go? good. Well, it's 2 0 here. I'm probably about to miss another goal. And we won the women's 7 0. So, uh, Pretty much smashing it here. No surprises. Oh, chance at a shot. Flat. I said Ted Carlson is leaving. Why, why are you leaving, Ted? Uh, um, yeah. It's a big game tomorrow. Big game tomorrow. Are you off? I've got the preps. Fantastic. Well, good, yeah, good luck, guys. <laughs> we'll have the prediction from Rico. See you, boys. That's commitment from them, to be fair. Oh, no! Hey! Oh, he's oh. sick. Score a goal when I'm filming. Henry um, Riley. Uh, yeah, we've got Riley. Oh. oh, please score a goal on camera. Please score. Got take. Oh. And 
Sounds like she had a bit of a nightmare today. I know, isn't it? Oh, please, please, please. Um, um, what was I going to say? Yeah, yeah. Problem, get that. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's just... <laughs> He's going, Luna, Messi, I've lost all my mates. Oh, there he is. Please score a goal. Please score a goal on camera. Oh my gosh, they don't turn, do they? No, they're not, they're not doing it for me yet. Oh, he got a goal! I recorded the goal! Yes! Oh, he recorded a goal. I don't think I... Henry Hayes of uh, men's cricket and uh, yep. also Brandon Baster for a soft drink manufacturer who can't of course name but uh, they, they make very nice fizzy drinks that make you very energised. Vitalising <laughs> body and mind. Oh, stop it, stop it, it's too slick. How, what are you making of the game so far? What's the score? I've forgotten. Really like it is actually. Is it like 4-0? Um, I think it is about 4-0. You know, I think actually Coventry are just getting back in the game a bit here. <laughs> Last sort of 10 minutes they've been in yeah. our half. Yeah, that, that's um, something. But. but Ultimately, I think obviously it's going to be a war at win. Mm. Just think fitness as well. You yeah, know? Just yeah. Think we got we got fit young men. You have got fit young men. That fit is fit young men, and that's going to you know. And you've last, got you've got Craig Nannestead on the sideline. He's the fitness coach. Craig, I've heard. Yeah, my my duple gang are Craig Nannestead. He is a duple. I was noticed. Um, I was going to say you two are quite similar. He, he was not my brother. Yeah, um, just to confirm that. Um, yeah, it's weird that uh, maybe it's separated at birth or something. It is. It is odd, and we're actually from the same town. Well, there you Bruce go. Did you ever meet each other? Same. No, we didn't actually. But anyway, that's a mark for this otherwise great game. Fantastic. Well, a part of an even greater week at Warwick Varsity. There you go, um, very slick. And a pleasure to be a part of oh. Raw and Warwick TV. Oh, wow, that's fantastic. Are you off to get a hot drink now then? Uh, yeah, I am. Well, actually, good, you know, good, I'm actually pretty cold. It's really good, it's pretty, absolutely free. Go Yes! Go, Holly. Great that you're here. <laughs> Holly asks, hey. thoughts, thoughts on the performance so far from the Magmen? They're smashing it. Could be more though. I mean, Could I want to see a few more goals. But do you want to see them outscore the girls though? Yeah, the I do. I do. Well, there you go. They're up to the challenge. Look forward to it. It looks like you've got a bit of heavy duty lifting to do there. Yeah, I know. Well, yeah, go enjoy yourself. <laughs> <laughs> The jam is oh, on. Craig David the all over the uh, You can do like a dance and Craig, the Craig dance David Renaissance. To summarise like thoughts on that performance. I'm liking the old school well, garage vibes. It yeah, wasn't quite the low. It wasn't quite the Do you want do you want them to outscore you though? Absolutely. I was gonna say No, it didn't even come out. <laughs> Absolutely not. Um, I mean let's be honest, they're a distinctly average person. <laughs> We've got no flair. Are your eels alright? Nah, he's average, you oh. know, they're all average. That's Sam Fisher bloke, who even is he? Like, <laughs> come on, we don't even know. They're not as good as the latest ones. True, but no, good to see, and I'm pretty sure we must be winning Varsity now. Um, I should think so. I mean, it's been absolutely shooing down here at the place, so. <laughs> Fantastic. Fingers crossed it's work. out of the point. I mean, I would cross my fingers, but I can't feel them anymore. Yeah, so I get that. That's I get life, that. basically. <laughs> I'm going home now. We're definitely going home if that's not upshot. <laughs>